Hello my gorgeous little angels, welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Antonia. If you'd like to come part of our magical online family, make sure you hit the red subscribe button down below, hit the notification bell, like the video, do all that amazing stuff because today, I mean, is it October or is it Christmas? Because Christmas is coming and I went to Primark and I picked up some goodies that are Harry Potter releases and upside down and back to front. <laughs> So I have the Harry Potter advent calendar from Primark this year. So if you'd like to see what's inside and what the calendar's like, then make sure you carry on watching. Right, to first off, I just want to say I do apologise about how dark it is. I forget about the dark nights come so early, like it's literally four o'clock. And it's pretty much bedtime outside, so sorry about that. And definitely get involved in the giveaway. It ends literally in like a week or so, at the end of October half term. So definitely go and get involved in that. I'll link the video down below so you can find out how it is you can win yourself some pins. So today we're gonna go on a little Primark little haul. I am in search of the actual like Hogwarts castle, but people queued literally on Friday outside to get it and people are putting it on ebay so it's sold out i didn't obviously go on the friday um so that's a bit sad but i'm gonna like keep my eye out for it and see if i'm able to get it um hopefully fingers crossed we can hope for the best um but yeah anyway i got this one so there was actually only two of these available i have literally only just took it out of the packaging. It's got spoilers on the back, so I'm going to avoid you from seeing them. This is only £10. It is the Stationery Advent Calendar, as far as I know. It just says Harry Potter Advent Calendar, but last year it was the Stationery one. I absolutely love the packaging this year. So much better than last year's. I will link last year's down below so you can have a little look at it. Go on a little bit of a hunt last year to get some Advent Calendars. I don't think I filmed them this early, though. I also reckon me Harry Potter, Ron Weasley... Wizards jump out, Molly Weasley, Nissers. This is from Primark because I'm a cheap girl and I ain't paying the price of Warner Brothers. So <laughs> I have got this. It's so comfy. It's so cozy. I have also got the Harry one to match. So I thought, again, in the vibe, I feel like I was going to put Harry on now because it's very blue vibes. Uh, but this is the back of the box if you want to see it. It says Hogwarts, School of Witchcraft and Wizardry, uh, Wizard and World characters, names and related indicia. Or one of those entertainment in publishing rights jkr so let's get that out the way it, it has got gryffindor hufflepuff which one's which slytherin's on this side and ravenclaw's on that side it's just really like an absolute it gives me really like uh, astronomy vibes like with the stars it's absolutely stunning and um, so we'll get on to open it because if i take too much longer then i think it's going to be like literal night time, but I'm going to show you the other goodies I got before I start opening it actually. Um, the one thing that I did get, which isn't Harry Potter releases, is a new phone case. This is just for Christmas, so I've got, um, it costs £3, I've got an iPhone 8 Plus, so I got the Grinch. Um, as I said, it's £3, let's take it out and have a little gander. Um, I just thought it was really cute and I love Christmas, so I just think this would be really cute to go on your phone. These days also have a stitch one. They add, um, so sorry, that was so noisy. They add Olaf. They add Minnie and Mickey. Like, they add quite a few. They add a friend's one, which is really cute because they add all the, um, stockings hanging with the, like the christmas lights that was lovely that one if you like friends but i got the grinch because i absolutely love the grinch like i just think it's a proper classic film and i really love the grinch like i just i do i love him as a character love the film proper christmas vibes and it's just a nice little rubber case it's not very bendy which is nice um but yeah got that and i did also pick this up which was only three pound fifty which i actually didn't even check the price i just picked it up it's again got that astronomy astronomy vibes um which is 2021 hogwarts calendar i think because i'm working days now this is going to be so good so it is like a little desk one unfortunately in work we don't have well some people have static desks but i personally don't um just because i'm not special enough so we can prop on your desk or obviously you can prop it on the side which i'll probably prop it here and then you can literally so we'll open it on off it's got the hogwarts looks like the um am i okay 
Marauder's Map. Oh my sweet mother of baby Jesus. That took me a minute. A minute. I was going to say, it, I, all I could think of was Mischief Managed. And I was thinking, what is it? Oh, wow. I promise you I'm a fan. I promise you. Um, but yeah, got that on the inside. And then you open it up. So it's labelled as the month. And then we have like January. It's got all the days in it. I just think this is so good. Because I'm going to write in like what shifts I'm on. Um, so I'm really excited about any birthdays that are coming up. Obviously, they can all be in there. They all look the same. Just obviously got the different month on top. If you can even see that, that one's June. Um, and then obviously we've got August. So I think that's really good because I work shift patterns now. Whereas I used to just work the evenings. It makes it a lot easier. And then we can actually go weekly. So it's actually got quite a lot. Like, so you can go through. So we go straight through from Monday to Sunday. It's a normal, regular week. And then you literally all just look the same so i just thought that was really cute like if there's anything in particular that week that you want to write in or like if you're on overtime or no, obviously it's not all work related but i'm on overtime this week and i'm doing 12 hour shifts so like little things like that just to like make notes like if you've already wrote in your shift pattern you can then obviously update it just that type of thing and i just thought for three pound fifty it's just really really pretty um i don't think there's anything on the back no it's just all plain blue um but yeah i just thought that was great for the price so now actually getting on to finally opening this uh, oh it's one and then that they're all over the place i will actually just show you the inside before i start attacking it this is so, honestly beautiful they did like a very similar like it was the same layout last year um but this is stunning i love the like literally all the stars and the gold foiling on it is always absolutely insane. There's the other side as well. It's just because I know number one's on this side. So number one is a Slytherin door. So let's get that on open. And what do we have on the first day? Obviously, again, if you don't want spoilers, don't watch. But is this like a little stamp? Oh, it's a little Ravenclaw, like a little stamp. These are so cute. If like you're a teacher, you can like stamp it piece of work to say like well done like if you like put them in little houses that is definitely something like if i become a teacher what i'd love to do but yeah it's like a little stamp that's number one and then number two is down here on the bottom which is like a little yule ball it is the little yule ball symbol um i always struggle to get these doors open and i have no nails so i have no excuse i was thinking about getting my nails done again but i'm not sure i haven't had them done for like over a year so like i'm scared because they've kind of like they're stronger, but they're still small, so they stress me out. Um, but we're very Ravenclaw themed. So this is a rubber, like a razor, if you want to call it a razor, but we call it, well, I call it a rubber. But yeah, it's got the little Ravenclaw. The other side is plain white, but that side is Ravenclaw. So very Ravenclaw themed, isn't it? Right, number three, I think number three is on the other side. There's number four. Number three, again, was a little girl ball, but this time it's like yellow themed. So let's get this size on open. Have you seen the Hogwarts castle that I'm on about where you put the thing in? Because last year they done the Hogwarts Express, which I did get and I absolutely love. We've now got a Slytherin eraser. Plain on the back. These are really beautiful. So I might actually do these sort of as maybe like in another giveaway, just because, I mean, I was thinking about becoming a primary school teacher, which I just think this would be so perfect for. Um... But I'm not at the moment. Oh, I like this. So it's like just a bit of gold washi tape. Again, if you didn't see one of my other videos, I, I bought quite a lot of washi tape lately. Um, like for Christmas, I just think it's really cute to sort of wrap presents up and things like that. Or obviously, if you like your scrapbook and anything like that, it's just really cute for things. I think number five is on the other side. Where's number five? There at the bottom. It's not it's on the bottom, yeah. Right under number four, as if I'm not legally blind. Uh, this is a Gryffindor one, so finally I've got a bit of house representation. Oh, and the, it's another rubber, but it's running away. Mad that the, <laughs> they give the rubber for this one, <laughs> absolutely massive door. Like, literally, there is number three, and there's number five, and look, at the, and it's the same item. <laughs> wild but yeah we've got gryffindor rubber now so we're just waiting on hufflepuff for the rubbers um so now number six well is it a hufflepuff door so maybe it's gonna give it no we've got a slytherin stamp so i'll just show you this and let's see the little stamp on the inside this is really cute can't really see it but it's got a little snake on it if you can see it but yeah 
I've still got all the stationery from last year, so I might just do a big stationery haul and um, ready for like maybe the new year or something like that. Let me know if you'd be interested um, for winning any stationery. I just don't personally use it myself. Um, so now we've got the highlighters. They did do this last year. Now, personally, I think this is a little bit cheap. Um, it's a basic yellow highlighter. Like, I'm, I don't mind the rubbers. I don't understand, like, the cheap, but, like, I don't like the prints on it. This is just a yellow highlighter with a sticker on, and the sticker's not even being put on properly. Like, let me just see if I can take, because I feel like the yellow's a bit... Can you see? That's not even centred. It's a Hogwarts sticker. Like, well, it's a H, but it says Hogwarts underneath. But, like... Like, why have you completely, like, not even stuck it on straight? Do you know what I mean? But it is only £10 at the end of the day. It is good for the price. And I think, like, if you just wanted, like, a... Like, I personally love a chocolate advent calendar. It's number eight. Um, just because, well, in fact, I don't love chocolate, so... <laughs> but I think if you wanted, like, an extra little thing to go alongside it, and obviously you love Harry Potter, you're also getting a nice Harry Potter little bit of mag magic every day. I couldn't even say magic then. Um... And it is really good for the price. It's just little, little tiny tweaky things. Like, I know they're a big business. But it's like, if you're going to stick the stick on, just, you know, put it on properly. <laughs> so now we have pencil, which is stamped as Warner Brothers. But it's just a gold pencil. Um, This one's a lot nicer. This one has got, like, the patterns on from the box. So at the top, we have Ravenclaw. It looks like it's just a Ravenclaw pencil. And with a little bit of Gryffindor. So it's just got the pattern sort of going round it. Quite nice. A lot better than just a basic gold. But then it's nice having them like together. They do look pretty. But I don't really understand what they're stamping. It's just a gold colour. But still very really pretty. But do you know what? I've come on to do this video because I thought I've been a bit of a negative neg lately. And I am really going heavy and strong at the Warner Brothers. Uh, we are on number nine by the way. Um, oh god, didn't want that door in it. Starts falling apart quite quickly, which is dead unfortunate because these are so beautiful, like honestly stunning. But I feel like they put so much effort into the exterior rather than the interior, which is a little bit disappointing. Um, I actually love these pens and I loved these pens when I was a kid. Like these are just my favourite pens in the world. So it is, it's got the same pattern as it is on the pencil and obviously on the box. And it's got all the different colours that you can, I absolutely, these are just my life. I actually think I will keep this because I think when you're writing, if you just want to grab a pen and you want to be a bit funky and writing like pink or blue or orange, that's my favourite so far. Like, I genuinely do really appreciate that and I love that. I think that's just dead quirky. Like, I love a bit of quirkiness. Um, but, yeah, I just... I'm, I'm trying to be a lot more positive because I'm not into being a little negative neg all the time. That is not enjoyable to watch. I just like to be honest with you. And if I'm not happy about something all the way people are being, then I can't hide it. We have these pink paper clips wow i'm struggling with speech um now they did do these in the last one i do appreciate them because realistically in a paper clip what really else can they do apart from a lightning bolt so i do really appreciate it it's a really subtle hint to harry potter obviously you get two um little paper clips which is really cute then we are number 11 which is right here with Hedwig on. I really love Hedwig and like I've been re-watching Harry Potter a lot lately because it's currently on Sky. So I literally have it on all the time. I'm just going to, I'm, I'm going to cheat and I'm going to go backwards. It's a little stamp that's fell out. So I'm just going to not open the door because that's struggling I'm not here for. So we have the little Hufflepuff one. More gold than yellow, I think. Um, oh, we have a cute little badger. That's cute, isn't it? You can see the little badger there. That is cute. I'm a fan. Right. Then number 12. Honest to God, I've, like, spoke way too much. I've kind of lost tangents of what I'm even on about now. <laughs> but, yeah. Let me just open this on up. If I can. This is a 25-day calendar, which is nice, though, because a lot of calendars aren't doing the 25 days. But, yeah, have you seen the castle? I really, really want the castle. It's currently on bidding for, like, £40, but it's still got, like, three days left on eBay, and I'm like, oh, oh. I feel like we could take the box off this outside, though. I mean, I don't know what you could keep it for, but 
DIY people could use it for something. You know, like, if, like creative people. I'm just not one of them people. Unfortunately, God did not bless me with that type of creativity lifestyle. I just appreciate people who can. So we now have the Gryffindor one. Can literally, oh my God. I was going to say it matches me. It pretty much blends in. And let's see, my house. Oh, I had it upside down. I was going to say, I couldn't even see the lion there. It really blends in with all the red, so I don't even know if you can see that. <laughs> Sorry, I feel like most of this video I'm like looking at like myself, which my eyes aren't going to look normal, but it's just so I can check that I am showing, is it? So we've got that one. What number was that? 12. Right, we've got 13 on the bottom. I'm just trying to like keep on top of so I don't keep you see it forever because I know the last video was very long. Ow. I am struggling with these doors. Something's moved, you see. Something's where it shouldn't be. Number 22's got a bit eager, so we'll just put number... Oh, no, that's not. It's the door. It's the door. It's the door. I thought we had a sneak peek then, but it's not. It's number four. Now, we have another paperclip, which actually I really like. It's a little Hogwarts one. I think this is really cute. would rather them do, like, a bigger one like that, um, but it's very bold in your eye. This is nice quality though. It's like really, it's nice. I'm a fan. Cute. Right, and then we're on to number 14. It's just got to be, yeah, it's got to be on this side. I was going to say, we've not had one on this side for quite a while. We've got quite a few on this side now though. Oh God, right. So now we've got more like little paper clips. But these are different ones. We've got H for Hogwarts, which is all gold. I think we've got two of the same of them. So I'll grab that one out. Yeah, we've got two of the same. And then we've got two black ones, which just have hate for Hogwarts again. So just pull them out. This is just really, like, it's a good little stationery set. Get you ready for the next year. Um, if you're in school or university or college or anything like that. And you've just got some nice little stationery bits of sort to just keep you entertained. So in number 15, we have this really cute little sticker set. Again, this is just nice to, like, spruce it up. I remember in primary school, you had to, like, decorate your books. Like, you could wallpaper them and put, like, no. You could wallpaper your book, yeah. <laughs> you could put, like, wrapping paper on your book. Just to make it a little bit more personal. I think little stickers like that just add a little bit of something to it. There's 16 back on this side. No, 16's there. Right in my face and I just didn't even see it. I've got quite a few on this. I've got 17, 18 and 19 as well. I'm trying to look at Ed so I don't keep his ear forever. Oh, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. So they are really sticking with like a gold theme in this one. So this is Harry's wand. So you can actually use it like a little wand, which is really cute. I actually really like that. And obviously it doubles up as a pen and then you can pop it in that way. Will it hold it? Yeah, it even holds it. So if you want to actually pop it on there and write. I'm left-handed, by the way. That's why I'm writing with this hand. But that is lovely. Big fan of that. So that and the little clicky pen. And we call them favourites. Um, and that's on 16. So now we're going to jump to 17, which is just a little door at the bottom. But if you've got any advent calendars this year coming, I personally want to get my hands on the Funko Pop one because I know there's a little bit of controversy because they've released a lot of the mini, like, little Funko Pops that you get in there from the first one that they've done. But I personally didn't get any of them, so it's great for me. But obviously, and they've put like new ones in it, but I personally want to get that one. So I want to try and get my hands on that and do an unboxing. So if you'll be interested, please comment down below and let me know. So you have a little Hogwarts. This is a little magnet, which I think is really, really cute. I will be putting that on. I was going to say popping it on, putting it. I'll put it together on my little magnet balls at the back, which I've got little photos on. Um, and then we've got 18. That is also from the magnet balls is from Primark as well. I do actually low-key rep Primark a lot more than I'd like to say. But I love Primark. Like, literally, I'm not a designer person. Um, right, that's all. Like, literally is having a meltdown. Just because I feel like I, I'd worry that I'd ruin stuff. So, I just stress myself out with things. Um, these are really cute. These are, which I just think are really cute if you just need to pop in your bag. If you're that, like kids or even if you just like coloring wherever you go they've got a little four pack of little pencils so you've got a red green yellow and blue so obviously you've got all the houses i think it's really cute if you add like a little harry potter coloring book and you've got like the basic colors so you could do like a gorgeous little hogwarts emblem 
that'd be lovely fan of them i like just like the little things that you can use on a daily um right 19 is at the top Oh my god, is it as if it took 19 days to get the hoverpuff rubber? Wow. <laughs> they took a while. <laughs> but yeah. Um, and then number 20 is this long one with heads were gone again. I'm just gonna try and be sneaky now and just try and go in. Oh, I think this is a ruler. From what I can feel. I know this is naughty, but look how butchered the, the calendar is. Oh, this is lovely. Okay, I like this as well. They all have the little sticky bits on the back. So if you can see me like pulling it off, that's what I'm pulling off. <laughs> you can see me messing with it, but that's all it is. Oh, that one won't come off. Get off. Oh, stick that there. Um, but yeah, we've got this gorgeous and it's got all the four houses on it. It's black and gold. I really love that. That's lovely. I'm going to put that in my bag. I really like that. And then 21 at the top. And I think we're nearly finished on this side. We're going to go, oh my God, see if we're nearly at the end. So now we have a sharpener to match. Um, I prefer the ones with the back on. I was seeing if it was off centre because it's really irritating me. Like I feel like I'm tilting it. But I don't know. I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm just being really dramatic now. It's really lovely. I love the fact it's sort of a matching set. It makes more sense with these being gold and the pencils. They are becoming like a nice little set to have. Um, I think it'd be really cute if they did like a little cute pencil case. I don't think they do anything like that. But I think that would be really cute if they had that sort of to be able to put your pencils and pens in and rulers and high. Well, we've only got one yellow highlight that they couldn't stick the thing on properly. So, <laughs> see if we've got any more of them just trying to get into 22 but it's just seems to be a little bit of a struggle right now oh because it's on a little so these are the little um got a little hogwarts so these are like the little that's the sticker that's on the highlighter um i think these like a little they're like little nails i don't really know what you'd use for them personally myself um like even like me whole education i don't feel like i use anything like that but they have them if you oh on a cork board you can nail them into a cork board couldn't yeah which is quite cute but um yeah not really a fan of that like a little h design i know they've got pretty much on everything because i feel like the black and gold theme but i quite i prefer it like with the houses i just think it looks nicer that's my just personal opinion um but yeah have you been able to pick this up yeah it literally sold out so fast like i was literally in there seeing two of them i was like oh i'll pick one up so i can do an unboxing for you um and then literally like someone else come and picked up another one and it was like they were gone literally while i was stood there they were just gone we do have a few other things so i've got a whole hot like whole hot goods a whole christmas section in primark now which is lovely um and it's just it's so nice it's on the first floor if you're in liverpool and you want to go and have a look but they have these little sticky notes i really like these i like the fact that they've gone white with them so obviously you can read what's written on them um and they're just lovely so obviously we've got Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hogwarts, Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw which is lovely give you the five really nice big fan of that and then we have Christmas Eve I'm so excited for Christmas Eve so excited I'm just I'm, I really want to start watching Christmas films but I feel like until we have Halloween out the way I feel like it's not acceptable I have listened to a couple of Christmas songs because I am ready for it this is really cute look they have all that sticky stuff on the back of them all look you see i am so sorry the video stopped filming and i didn't know that it did but i was only showing you that we do have a to-do list i did actually write on it for you so it says subscribe um i do think that the writing like the, the blue pen is from this by the way oh my god that's really threw me off that i'm gonna stop filming um but yeah really cute and you can't really see the handwriting on it though which is the only thing i was saying i feel like it's a little bit difficult to see and in door 24 hours, I'm so sorry that you didn't see, was this really cute notepad. I think it's absolutely beautiful. Actually, one of my favourite items in there. I really love the gold and black theme that it's got going on. Um, if you do pick it up, you can see on the back. Obviously, if you're either buying it for yourself and you want the spoilers, or if you're buying it for someone else and you want to make sure it's something that they would be interested in, that you can get on the back it has a spoiler on the back of everything that's in it i do really enjoy the black and gold aesthetic i have to say my least favorite thing was this i feel like on the packaging it looks gold when it's yellow the sticker's not on properly i feel like that's just the least thing i'm interested in um but yeah i do think it's really good for the value 
if you definitely want to buy it for someone who you think would love stationery, it's perfect. And I, but I fully, fully say, fully 100% think, think this is worth it. I couldn't even get my sentence out then. I absolutely love this. But I think how cute that's going to be with like, that like, like, I don't know whether that looks cute, but I'm just really a big fan of having this with it. I just, I'm a big fan. But anyway, really hope you did enjoy today's video. Please subscribe, like, and comment. I do think it is very similar with the items from last year, but they've just done it in a different colour variant, which I prefer this year's 100%. But there's a couple of advent calendars I definitely want to try and get my hands on, which is the Funko Pop one. Um, but let me know which ones you are trying to get your hands on, whether you need to try and get your hands on this. If you need any help, if I can try and pick any up, I definitely will have a look. Um, if you need any, please help me try and find the castle one if you can, or if you're looking for it, let's help each other in the comments. But I really hope you did enjoy today's video. I think I've said that about five times. Really hope to see you in the next one, but for now, bye bye. <laughs>